She goes down hard. I hear her head smack against the pavement. I stand up and look around. Wake is dazed and unable to stand, but I see certain agents making their way towards us through the crowd. I've got to get out of here. I take a step. A sharp pain stabs through my body. The crash must have broken a bone in my leg. It doesn't matter. I have to get to the lab and time leap again. That's the only way to save my Yuri. I look back at the site of the accident. Wake is slowly re gaining her feet, but Mayuri remains limp and motionless on the road. It breaks my heart to leave Mayuri lying there, but I have no choice. I have to go back to the lab. Finding the pain of my broken leg, I managed to drag myself back to the lab. Surprisingly, Sirens men didn't chase me. Nobody's at the lab when I arrive. Only the lights are still on. Relieved that Kurisu and Daru haven't turned. Return. I head straight to the development room. We should lock the door and then, you know, go over there. Maybe it was locked before, too, when the five men came in, but still. Because maybe they kicked in the door quite easily. I remember to break into the Braun 2 workshop to turn on the 42 inch CRT. Oh, okay, good. My body is drenched in sweat. And I can't stop shivering. Everything hurts, especially my right side, where the car hit me. If I'm not careful, I might lose consciousness. My vision is blurry. It's hard to focus. My left arm is numb and can barely move. But still, I force myself to activate the X68000 and input the settings. I'm gasping for breath like a wounded animal. The sound of my breath beat fills my ears. Mayuri. Heartbeat, maybe it said. I don't know. They killed her again. I failed to protect her. I'm sorry, Mayuri. I'm sorry. Choking back my tears, I frantically pound on the keyboard. Police sirens echo in the distance. Mueke hit Mayuri in front of her. Hundreds of witnesses. They'll probably take her in for questioning. Even if CERN bails her out somehow, she should be stuck for at least a couple of hours. The real problem is her men. Those mercenaries, or whatever they were, CERN's hit squad. Why didn't they come after me? It should have been easy for them to catch me, injure as I am. Yeah, exactly. This is weird, but still, part-time warrior is saying that I'm still on this, you know, maybe we shouldn't trust Kurisu. Because that makes sense. Because if part-time warrior's father is the time traveler, then he knows what who Kurisu is, maybe. <sighs> I need to hurry. If they show up here, they'll kill me for sure. Settings complete. I put on the headgear. I'll get blood on it. But that doesn't matter. A surge of anxiety washes over me. What if the time leap fails? What if my memories are corrupted? I might forget who I am. I might lose myself. Should I really use the machine? Of course I should. I curse my weakness. <laughs> My you're dead, remember? This can't be allowed to happen. No risk is too great. I will save my year, whatever it takes. I alone have the power to change the past. What am I waiting for? Swallowing my fear, I activate the time leap machine. Screeching in my ears, kneeling stabbing into my brain, a thousand emotions flooding my senses. The world bends, pulses, and returns to normal. The pain of my wounds have vanished like magic, replaced by a piercing pain in my brain. I fight back a wave of nausea and take stock of the situation. I'm sitting on the sofa with my phone to my ear. 
another successful time leap that makes three. Do you guys remember this, you know, during the start of this whole journey that we saw Kurisu get killed or was killed? Maybe she's going to get killed now. Maybe we should trust her. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see. Because she sh wouldn't have killed herself, right? Or maybe that is not going to happen in this... In this world. It looks like the time leap machine works perfectly. I'm sure it would boost Kurisu's confidence. If I told her. But that will have to wait until Majuris out of danger. I stand up and look around the lab. Well, everybody is in danger, if you think about it. I don't think that they are going to be very nice towards, you know, Daru and, and us and Kurisu. Stand up and look around the lab. Where's Mayuri? Well, she, she was out shopping, right? Because she had a, her bag. What? Crazy. Who was dozing off next to me, wakes up with a jerk at the sound of my voice. <sighs> Don't shout. I've been working all night, so let me rest a bit. Where is my Yuri? What's wrong with you? She went to look at she's remember? Damn, she already left? I should call or send a mail. But the thing here is that her phone is out of energy. Right? I need to get in touch with her somehow. Miru went to see someone after leaving the shrine. The question is who? Think. Consider every possibility. Damn. Why did I forget? Before I time leave, I should have asked Mayuri where she was today. Yeah, I know. I'm not thinking straight. I have to calm down. Yeah, I guess. When you are in a panic mode, then it's uh, a little bit harder to think. Wait, I know. Last time we failed because we went to Akihabara Station. I should have known that CERN would be watching. This time, we'll take a taxi to another station, then hide somewhere until things calm down. For now... All I can do is wait for Mayuri to return. It's driving me crazy. We should have the we should always have the time leap machine by our side. And can't we time leap like further than just two hours? Maybe we can't. Unfortunately. I consider explaining the situation to Kurisu and Daru, but I just don't have the strength to do that right now. God damn it. Besides, I don't want to get them involved. You don't want them to get involved, god damn. That is... Okay. I'll take care of it myself. I won't let any more of my friends die. As before, the Braun 2 workshop closes early. Mayura appears as Susu and Mr. Braun are leaving. We run through Kanda Mojin's back street to Ushan no Misu station, taking only minimal precautions, precautions to avoid attracting attention. We have to get there before the Sobo line shuts down. We managed to get, make it to the station without being stopped, but when we get there, I see a group of men waiting by the entrance. They look like CERN. Change of plans, we turn around and head for the Shin, Shin Ushan no Mitsu subway station. We arrive at the station later than I intended. I don't usually come here, so I got lost. I stare nervously at the platform clock. According to the scrolling display, the Yaman Note, Kei, to Huku, and Subu lines are already suspended operations. Wait, it looks like the Shibyoda line has too. It must be protocol to assume that nearby station may be threatened, even station on unconnected lines. Damn, 